What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. We are here with Arthur, and we're actually over by the Trapper, which is a good thing, because I think I want to buy the legendary hat that he made. I know it's 40 bucks, and it kind of it kind of seems like a lot, because I do want to save right now. But if you think about it, the legendary animals that we kill, if he can make it into an item, I think it's best that we just get it. So, something came up in the journal, and it... There we go. I was to say, it doesn't look like we can open the journal. For some reason. Page. Found an odd-looking corpse. Wait. Found an odd-looking corpse. Something stuffed into the mouth. Couldn't make sense of it. Oh, that's that note of the killer. We're gonna go back because we read that. A horse dog. Oh, this is the vultures that we killed. Remember? And then I believe that time we killed all the vultures, we did kill a fox too, and a deer. There's the cougar, the guy that we saved from the cougar. There's another dog. Rabbit with Hosea, and then a new horse that we got. Has to be. Nothing. Arthur. Took a day off and went hunting with Hosea. He really seems to be getting his strength back a bunch. Although he was lucky not to die as this big bear he'd been after turned on us. I don't think it was ever our friend to turn on us. I thought when we were stuck in the mountains that the cold and the misery would kill him. And we'd bury him like we buried Jenny and Davy. But he pulled through and he'll live a while yet. I think he's got a lot of life in him. A lot of life in them old bones. Wild carrot, there's the carrot. I love Dutch like a father, but in many ways, I love Hosea even more. He's kind and fair, and like a human being. Dutch is something else. Despair was something else. Size of a goddamn hotel. <laughs> it was mean with it. Yeah, it was pretty mean. And wild carrots. We found wild carrots there. We sure did. There's the bear! Whooped its ass. Legendary bear. Beastly. Oh, and that's it. Okay. Show gang savings. Let's look at the gang savings. Um, it looks about the same. Look at this freaking weather. We're gonna get the. Welcome back. Hey, friend. Let's go ahead and buy the hat. All made to measure. Even if we don't wear it, so be it. Garment sets. Oh, we have a bunch more. Hey, we didn't look at all these. Mountain Man. The Night Wrangler. The Desperado. Ooh, that's kind of slick. The Marauder. Ooh. I like that one, too. Because you know I like the whole black on black look for Arthur. Desperado and the Marauder. Oh, come on, will you? The mountain man, <laughs> look at this motherfucker. <laughs> Is it clothing? These hats are crazy. Where would we... Items, gotta be items. Everboard belt, no. What was that legendary hat at? Reinforce equipment? Master hunter? No. Horseman, no. Sharpshooter. There's that. I feel like... Did we miss it? Nah, we couldn't have missed it. Clothing? Has to be clothing. Hats. Oh, he doesn't sell it anymore. I don't think. I think we missed it. Ever been down in Gaptooth Ridge? Local legend speaks of a white cougar, Giaguro. Well, no let's look at sets first. For the legend right here. Oh, it's a whole. It's a whole set. I get it now. Okay. There's the whole set. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. So we got. We're gonna pretty much get together a whole set by killing. Some of the things folks bring. It's just all this. All types of legendary stuff, then.
Let's look at the info on it. Slightly warm, paired with other warm items for protection from cold. Thanks for the legendary bear hat. So we got it on right now. I don't want to wear it right now. <laughs> Arthur's gonna scare the fuck out of people. See you later, Trevor! Have a good day. Look at his hat! You look like some kind of a mascot or something, man. <laughs> Come on. We're gonna pow around in this shit for now. Okay, boy. Come on, Brucey. How you like my hat? <laughs> Alright, last episode I talked about going to these houses here. Let's try to go over here and see if there's anything there. We are going to make it back to camp. I know we will. We just, um... We'll get there. Maybe. <laughs> Possibly. Is it this way? Let's look out for these trees. Hey, partners! Easy, easy. Take it easy, take it easy. Should we whoop this deer up? Nah, we'll let him live. Live to fight another day, deer. There's another one. The game is teaming over here. Yep. Now, to be honest, this would be a really good place to hunt. There's been- oh. Wrong way. There's been a lot of animals here. So if we ever want to hunt, this is probably a pretty good spot to go. There we go. Just go off road and then. All right, Brucey, I'm gonna keep you. I wanna keep you over here, but maybe we should just take you to this place. Anyone home? Don't mind me. There we go. We need to eagle eye more. I don't think I use it enough in certain situations. Look at Arthur's fucking head. Oh my word. There's all types of stuff in here. Seriously, just could be a place to loot. It might not be anything. Jewelry. Oh my. Nothing. You can't carry any more of these items. Maybe we should eat some of this stuff. Let's eat something anyway. Why not? Sure. How about we eat... Cooked game meat? Let's eat the cooked game meat. Yummy. Can't carry any more of these items. We need to upgrade our backpack. I think the one that sounded the most interesting in Pearson's set was the legendary. East Satchel or something like that. Obviously, it's legendary. I think that's something we should really prioritize. Because, well, I'm a loot whore motherfucker! I am! I love looting in games. So, the more we keep looting, is that a... It's like a Bible, yeah? Book? Inspect letter. Oh. Flip. Well, this is a big old ordeal here. Letter to Martha from Garfield. August 17th, 1864. My dearest Martha, I miss you so much. Life makes sense when we are together. This war no longer makes sense to me. When I signed up, oh, it seemed like a thousand lifetimes ago. Everything seemed so simple. We were going to express our rights as states do, as we goddamn well please, and hang whatever any fools in the North told us. I cannot believe that this was a principle I would die for, and yet... It is a principle I have seen so many men I grew up with be slaughtered for. That and their own stupid pride. We southerners are such proud fools. Now I am only proud about one thing, the love I share with you. You, a Yankee, an abolitionist, that's the word. Everything I am supposed to hate and now love so dear. How can you love me back when I am such a fool? I cannot wait for this war to end. I thought many times about running away, but General Harris has taken to shooting deserters. I am still too proud to allow for that. It seems we are. We go down. Oh. It seems we are heading towards the enemy camp in Scarlet Meadows. 
for one last battle. We have almost no chance of winning, our morale is almost entirely spent, and the Yankees are far too strong. But after the accusations of cowardice leveled against General Harris for his failure to support General Quinn last month and all that drama, he seems hell-bent on a fight. I even overheard General Smith complaining in the officer's mess about General Harris. None of his junior officers trust him very much anymore. I hope I do not die. Not because I care two figs for myself, but because the sadness it would bring to you. I miss you, yours, Garfield. Oh, so it's telling us about the war between basically North and South. Flip. Can we read the back? Oh, no. Okay. Garfield. Letter to Martha. I wonder if we can bring that to Martha. Because this looks like Garfield. Maybe that's Martha. I think that's Martha, friends. Damn, I'm sorry, Garfield. It looks like Martha's been gone for a minute. She really has to be because, I mean, she's a bones now. Oh, that's terrible. Give me that chin. Look at Arthur's hat. <laughs> hey, Martha, you did have a nice place. Yeah, this place has been deserted for a while. There's spider webs in the mirror or the window and everything. Well, I guess it's better that Arthur takes it, yeah? Instead of the bandits. Chocolate bars. <laughs> Fucking chocolate bars. <laughs> so this don't count as a, um, a shack, probably. Brown coffee. It doesn't seem like it does. Well, this is a random shack, and I had, like, a nice little tail here. But... It doesn't look like... Actually... Let's pull my gun out. Just eagle and iron in here. Making sure there's nothing. Alright, let's get on Brucey and head over to the other place. <laughs> Look at her. I just can't. <laughs> Arthur, I don't even know. I just... Hey, Brucey. Okay, let loose. Okay, boy. Where's the other one? Over here. Oh, wow. It's got us going all the way back. I just... Don't you think we can just cut right across, maybe? But probably not. We probably really have to take the road. And that's fine. Well, that was an interesting little tale. Did we just run over a squirrel? I think we ran over a squirrel. The man went to war. The woman... So I'm wondering if he actually met her before. Oops. Ran over more ammo. I'm telling you, the it's teeming. Wildlife is teeming here. Anyways, I'm just wondering if he met her beforehand or after. I'm thinking that he met her after he went to war, basically. Hey. What are you doing? Hey, careful how you go. Can't you see I'm tracking game here? Sorry. Good. You see this hat I got? Let's track it together. I'll pull my shotgun out. We got this. Come on. You and me. Let's put that away. Put it away. How do we put it away? There we go. I thought I saw you over there. <laughs> That's just... Oh, look at the size of that thing! Oh, no, no, no! Oh, shit. Break free! Where'd you go? <laughs> he fucking rolled out! 
I couldn't get my gun out fast enough. It wasn't pulling it out. Arthur, we almost died. Hey. Let's pick up our hat. <laughs> Put our hat on and it gets dark. Whoa. We just killed a grizzly bear. Friends, we got that shit kicked out of us. I was seeing that there was something on the bottom there. I just couldn't... I couldn't fully see what it was because I was just pressing buttons. Holy... That didn't go as well as the legendary bear. Grizzly bear. You're gonna harvest all the animals parts? Yes, we need to upgrade. Fucking Christ. What the hell is going on? The grizzly bears are endemic to grizzlies east. As an omnivore, its diet ranges from berries, roots, and grasses to deer, elk, fish, and carrion. Easiest way to take down an animal of this size is with a rifle. Either high velocity or express bullets. Pair meat, fat, claws can be used for food or materials to craft with. <sighs> Woo! My heart's pumping. Arthur, you got mauled by a bear. I think we should eat something. Let's put this on. It's a poor. It's poor. We'll go sell it to the trapper now. But it's poor. Right. Oh, okay, no, no. Boy. What, are nice what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing, Arthur? Let's pick up the pelt. Put it on Brucey. <laughs> Damn, friends. That was rough. I wasn't expecting him to be tracking a bear. But we need to, uh, <laughs> keep our senses here. <laughs> we need to be more careful. Always on the edge in this wild world. Hold on. I don't want the horse cargo. I want Arthur's backpack, please. Animal fat. Provisions. Let's eat plain game. There you go, Arthur. You're looking good. And it, it let there be daylight again. <laughs> we are bloodied up. We are complete. Oh, look at all the scratches in us. On our arm. Let's change our outfit. You think it does anything? Hold on. Or. There we go. Awesome. Swap to the Winter Gunslinger. And then... <laughs> How do I get rid of this hat? We gotta take this fucking hat off. Author's hat, there we go. Friends, we were tore up! Well, that was really awesome. Um... Let's, uh, keep on moving, yeah? Yeah! Oh, we hear something! On the side of the road, I think it's always going to be interesting to go ahead and see what's going on with it. The legendary hat that we got, it's basically just a set. I was wondering if it might be some kind of uh, stat boost or something. It doesn't too much look like it. There's a lot of turkeys around here. I want to take one, but maybe we shouldn't. We can think about getting another horse. If we stumble upon a wild horse or something, possibly taming it, and there we go. Then we got our pack mule right there. Instead of waiting for other to get out other Brucey, yeah? Okay, it's just right up here. We'll be careful though. What is this? Doesn't look like too much, actually. Is this an... Oh, look, it's an old and abandoned mine. I wonder if we could open this. Get the shotgun out. No. <laughs> Alright, Arthur. Doesn't look like there's no getting in there. 
This is an old abandoned mining mine. <laughs> mining mine. It's an old abandoned mine. Nope. Doesn't look like there's anything here. Alright, well, let's head back to camp then. Alright, boy. Alright, boy. Look at the map. We'll head back to camp. Actually, we'll head to the tracker first. Trapper. Turn that in, and then, jeez, camp is, uh, it's a pretty long trek to camp. It sure is. Heading over to the trapper. I came across this tree, and it's got inspect on it, so let's inspect this tree. Trail trees? Oh. Also just draws it then. Age. Oh, so this draws the tree itself. Alright, well, see, this is the whole thing about not using enough eagle eye. Trail trees? What does that mean? It's marking the trail of something. But... Yeah. What exactly? Go to the trapper. Sell that poor hide. We'll be- uh, Brucey, I'm sorry. I'm a bad driver. Rider. So this hide, I can't imagine it being worth much. Hey, I got this really awesome- I don't we- Put away our weapons. Put that one away, I can't put away my damn shotgun. Remove the belt. Help. Remove the belt. That would be a big ass belt to put around you, huh? Look what I got just hey, for you. That belt? I sure am. I want you to have it. All right, let's have a look. It's poor. Three dollars and seventy-five cents. I guess that was worth being mauled. Well, I can take it, I suppose. Bear claw. I don't know if I want to give you that. I said, well, I can take it. It's in shitty fucking condition, but I'll take it. I'm gonna keep the bear claw. Just in case we need it. Never know. Now, let's make our way to camp. Alright, we are close. Closer to camp. We stumbled on something called Emerald Station. There seems to be a few things here. Domino's Draw. Post Office. And a Stagecoach. Can't we fast travel with the stagecoach? There was nothing else though. It was a big empty road on the way here. So, Emerald Station though. Interesting. Can I give you a ride somewhere? You sure the fuck can? Or shoe overlook? Let's not though. Hey, move it! I Hello, mister. How do you do? You look like a man on a mission. Mm-hmm. You do. So, don't let me keep you. You take care now. Take it easy, partner. Hello. Darn people. Howdy. Hey there. What do you want? Let me play cards. Uh, don't run into many folks out this way. If you say so. All right. Stay safe. Stay Bye safe, partner. Now. What is this? Welcome, friend. Train tickets? Pay bounty? Oh. Okay. Thank you. Really? Well, not much here. It's dominoes or something. Oh, hold on. Play draw dominoes for one dollar? Hey, you want in here? By the whoops of my ass. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's play. I thought we played dominoes. <laughs> Draw game. Win round by being the first to place all your tiles. We're just guessing. Look at these degenerates that were just sat down with a game of dominoes. <laughs> this is great. Come on. Free look. Can I see yours? Oh, I can't see yours. You tiles. 
Force me to view your tiles. How the fuck can we play dominoes? <laughs> Restore view, view table. Uh, this tile has no available moves. Please select another tile. But you tell me what to do first, unless I missed it. We wait for the cows. Hey, I'm trying to figure out what the fuck is going on. <coughs> Ooh, I think I get it. Domino's is like. Yeah, see? There's a five here. This is mine. You have to put, like, the same number off of the last one. So I'll have to do a two here. Or a three. Right here. I'm pretty sure that's how it is. I mean, I, it's been years since I played something like this. Sixes. We can do the six, but we'll probably... Yeah, it'll go, it'll go down or up. Oh, you're winning, friend. You got some Fine. good shit going on. How, how did I get that? Why am I? Someone's am I, in need of divine intervention. You son of you a gun. You need a miracle now. <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Okay, sure. Friends, we got our ass handed to us. Why do we have to redraw? I can, like I said, I can vaguely remember playing this a long time ago when I was in the military, but I just don't know. Four. Yeah, right here. We'll make a comeback, friends. Don't you worry. He's only got two left. He's about to bust our asses. No, How you not me. That's a D-O-M-I domino. Ain't gonna turn my nose up at that. Bob? You did well out of my idiocy here. <laughs> hey, Bob. The 49 bonus points are awarded to the winner. Damn, Bob, you wrecked. You fucking did. Should we do another one? It was two out of three, right? Or... You just got a lucky hand. Every time we put something down, or he put something down, this motherfucker just had something to put down there. It's all about luck. All these mini games and games ever are always about luck. It really is. And that's okay. Six tiles left. Okay, let's view our tiles. I'm ready. Six. I want to get back to camp though. But this is a nice little introduction to, uh,. We're learning it on our own, basically. It's not really much tutorials on this. Fives. Let's see, let's see. There's a five here. Sure. And we can only go on the ends. We can't... We can't put it in the middle here. It always has to go off the ends. Like, look at Bob. He's just rolling. You're a roller, Bob. It's kind of like connect. You can't connect something that's in the middle. I don't think. Or maybe you can connect these ones. The ones that kind of go All up. Alright, there we go. Alright, there we go. Why are we doing more? Why do we have to draw more? And they don't draw more. I'm not understanding that. One. What is this, nothing? There are no tiles available. Well. Ain't this fun. Ain't this fun. Motherfuckers, they always got something. So you can't do anything here. I tried to do the five here. But there's no five there. So maybe we're drawing because we don't have anything. Basically. Two. We can go six here. This is cool. I really love mini games. Four. We got a six again. But we have a nothing here. We can put this up here, though, yeah? And we can't. He's picking it up. There's something to do. 
Free luck. Author, you can pick it up and use it up here. There it is. Go ahead and draw, because I'm about to whoop it with this last one. You want to put a six or a three down? Five. Ooh, you don't have nothing this either. This ain't looking gonna... great for you. This ain't looking great pass. for neither of you. I'll pass. Gotta pass. I'll take everything I can get. Well, you'll get something from me. Oh, About fuck. time! I was due some luck. Unfortunate for you. How the fuck did you win, Bob? I had one left! You can buy in, play, or leave the table. I'm out of here, Bob. Guess I better go. How did Bob win? Oh, hell no, we lost one dollar. <laughs> Ooh, that was that was interesting. I will learn it the more we keep playing it, of course. But that was really cool. Really, really cool. Let's see what this place is about. There's a place over here. So to be honest, I just really want to get a the main quest on because Emerald Ranch. I'm kind of scared to open places like this. Maybe we might be doing something out of order. Because there's specifically nothing here. Hey, Brucey, hang out a bit, all right? Let me go talk to this house owner, probably. You got a beautiful area here, sir. I ain't gonna rob you. Howdy. Hey, the hell do you want here? I just wanna say hi. I ain't here to cause trouble. All right, I'm out of here. <laughs> he did not like us going to his That's house. Cool. Let's get the fuck out of here. Emerald Ranch. We came. We saw. Anything else around? Let's go over here. <laughs> Damn, Bob done fleeced us. Did we lose more than one dollar? I think we only lost one dollar. But still. You wanna bite me? I'm real nice. How you doing? Hey, boy. Let's study him. Australian Shepherd Dog. Good boy. Oh, that's cool. Hey, sir. Howdy. Hello. I like you, Mister. You have a kind face. Mmm. The kind I like to punch. You got something to prove here? <laughs> Calm down. <laughs> I knew he was going to say that. I fucking knew it. <laughs> I had to do it. Let me look at the map and see what we got. We don't have much else going on at Emerald Ranch. I'm guessing in time, things will probably open up here. And that's okay. Because I really do want to get back to camp here. Uh, howdy. Hey, mister. What are you doing this for, huh? I'm just trying to get back on the road. Sorry. Damn, Brucey! How you doing? <laughs> Let's go. Let's get out of Emerald Ranch. We literally... We lost all our money here. Yeah. Domino's is really interesting. It's about luck, yeah. Most games like that. It's always about luck. I don't see how Bob won at the end there, though. We had one lap. Did he win by default since he won the first one? I don't know though. Like I say it's a, it wasn't much in the tutorials. Well, it wasn't much tutorial for it at all, really. Yep, yeah. detouring. This is just a house out by itself. Hang in there, Brucey. I gotta see what's going on. All right. I know. I know. Hey there, partner. Just calm down. I'm out of here. <laughs> he's gonna fucking shoot us. Look, he's, he's red on the map. Alright, people don't like it when you come up to their houses. Oh, man. This game is crazy. 
It really is. It's like real life. I mean, come on. Some random person just comes up to the house, parks the horse, gets off, walks up to you. Hey, partner. Hey there. Evening, mister. How you doing? Hey, partner. See the smoke? What is that? I just have a feeling that we won't yeah. really be welcome here. Yep. You yep. got it, Brucey. Come on, Brucey. It ain't nothing for you. Let's go say hi to him. You see any welcome sign around here? Go on with you. Get out of my sight now. Just <laughs> minding my own business. <laughs> I just yeah. want to talk to people. Let me talk to you. <laughs> you see any welcome sign here? Look at these graphics in the background. Look at the mountain. It just, it seems so Western. You know, it just fits it so well. I hear the coyotes. <laughs> I think we ran an animal over, <laughs> to be honest. Let's pick yeah. that son of a bitch up. Good hunting, Brucey. <laughs> Real good hunting, Brucey. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, there, you just dropped it on the ground. Pick that sucker up. Oh, what are you stopping it for? <laughs> what the fuck is going on? They set me up. I'm an innocent man. Hey. Enough out of you! Oh no. Stay back from the wagon, sir. Transporting a fugitive. So, what did they do? And just what in the hell is your problem? Hey! Hey, you! Please! You, you gotta get me out of here! I won't ask again! Move out of the way! We're gonna have to pull something out. Let me out of here! I got a wife and kids! Your choice! Put him down! We're getting negative points. Let me out. Shoot the Friends. You can free the prisoner, we're freeing a prisoner. You gotta break me out of here, please! Damn it. I feel like I'm Oh, that's a gun. The lock! The lock! Shoot! Oh, oh. Wanted Arthur Come Morgan. On. Where's the line? Law searching. Am I glad you showed up when you did? I don't have no money to give you, but I do have some information that might interest a man like yourself. There's this odd lady who collects things. Has a place uh, north of Strawberry. All kinds of goodies I hear. <laughs> might be. Something there for you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. Thanks again. Safe Robert travels. Tip. Yeah, you too. Lay low. <laughs> we got a repeater. <laughs> Damn! Oh! Shit! I guess I deserve that. <laughs> no, no, loot him! I'm gonna pick up these corpses, take them off the road. Law men are searching. <laughs> oh, this was a law man. Friends, we. <laughs> I don't know what is good to do and what isn't good to do. It's it's so hard to to tell. In that situation, I'm gonna go ahead and leave you there. Oh no. Come on. Come on. Be right the hell there. You move one more time, I'll drop you. Boy, Fifty dollar bounty. Shit. Oh no! <laughs> They're getting away. Come on. 
<laughs> Damn it. Come on, keep on going. You are gonna lose ground because Brucey is legit. We got a $50 bounty. How do we lose these guys? This is great. <laughs> The law is close to camp. Avoid leading them there. Okay. Get over here. Brucey, you're not looking good. I'm sorry. And we got a $50 bounty. Not good. Well, your horse's stamina is empty. Can you push your horse? It will buck you off. Okay. Sorry, Brucey. Hang in there. All right. Looks like we're going to lose him. Probably by Valentine now. <laughs> this shit is so crazy. <laughs> okay. Things are happening in the world. Yeah. We need to start using our head a bit more. Because... Let's hunt. Items. Hold on. Repeater. Let's do the varmint. And they get the bow. We get the varmint out because there's something. What is that? If that's a dog. Study. Oh, it's a fox. We get a bounty in New Hanover. Sure, take that piece of grass and love it, Brucey. Where'd he go? Oh, we not kill it? Shit. Friends, we got a bounty of $50. <laughs> we killed the lawman. <laughs> Shit. We've seen better days. What is that? Nothing. Well, I'm trying to hunt here to get the law off of us. I tried to hide one, but I don't think we got out of there fast enough. I picked up a repeater, though. Oh, you're gone out, Arthur. Hey, I'm hunting here. You don't mind? It, maybe we missed the other one. Call? Shit. <laughs> Let's head back to camp. Well, it's probably safe to not get a mission on, but I will still want to head back to camp and talk to people yeah. before next episode, because next episode, well, now that we're going to be back at camp, we'll definitely be able to start. There's more horses. Your horse is dirty. You hear all these animals? Well, a horse is dirty, so let's... Can we brush the horse? It's all right, boy. There howdy. you go, Brucey. Hey, howdy, partner. Don't mind them. The lull men over there. Well, the gentleman gave us a tip on a place to rob. <laughs> okay. I'm thinking that these things that we're letting people go, like... You okay? Okay, we let that guy go. We got points for actually getting them out of there, so it was good that we got them out of there, but we lost points for killing the lawmen. I think the ultimate answer to that probably would have been shoot the lock off and then hightail it. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. But the gentleman probably would have never gave us... Or maybe, okay, maybe we lost points because they didn't really fire at us first. Did they fire at us first? Hmm. Interesting. Any more animals over here? Because all I got is a rabbit. Yeah, there we go. What is that? Man, we're out of, uh... We need that eye. Bad. Tonics. 
Fully restores dead eye. Oof, our core has seen better days. <laughs> Pull your gun out, Arthur. There we go. All right, Brucey, you all right? I killed a coyote, though. Yeah. Yeah, good boy. Got him with a varmint. Coyote. Let's get him. Take him back and let Pearson cook him up. Won't take long, boy. It ain't gonna take long. I'll get him, and we'll take him back. Feasting. <laughs> <laughs> or can, oh, we can put put the pelt on. That's fine. Put the pelt on Brucey. I mean, we got a rabbit. We got something. Hey, we got something for the camp. It's better than nothing, right? We go in there with something. At least they have some kind of food. Look at our dead eye core. It is done for. The coyote's gonna be on the back. Yeah, sure is. All right. I think we're close enough to camp. Let's just go inside. Let's go inside camp. I want to talk to some people. See how people's doing. We can leave chores for... Who's there? It's Arthur Morgan! Arthur! Hope you had a good old time while I've been stuck standing here. Hey, Bill. <laughs> You're on punishment, I think. <laughs> you been out of trouble there? Of course I am. Good. I'm done with trouble for a while. Okay, then. <laughs> Friends, I missed our... our gang. We're gonna have to go pay that bounty. I don't think it goes away. Damn. Well, we have to try new things, right? We have to try things out. We gotta see how the structure of the game is. We pay bounties. That's... Oh. That's the only thing I can think of. I mean... You can craft, sit near the fire and craft. Okay. Well, it was exciting. <laughs> it was it was really exciting. Hey, Pearson, I got this stuff, all right? I don't want to bring it over. You can just take it from me. Donate! This stew it's is like decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. Or coyote carcass. All right, let's see what we got. You getting meat? Oh, they are get. He is getting meat from that. Big game meat here. This should Have that. be some real good eating. I'm keeping the rest. All right. Stringy meat. Well, there you I'll go. take what I can get. <laughs> Enjoy it. Thank you, Arthur. It's delicious. Arthur. Let's go put some money in the thingy, Majiggy, and then we're gonna take a nap. Contribute. Ooh. I'm telling you though. We'll give Platinum bracelet. Let's give some of these. Donate. Here. I'm not gonna give them all of them. Just give them a few. Probably best that we keep this stuff, maybe? You never know. Donut items. There we go. Where do we go to upgrade stuff, though? Hey, folks. Hello, Arthur. Hope you're working on a plan there. Always. Hello. Anyway. Yes, Arthur? Won't disturb you. Okay. Yes, Arthur? Always good to see you. <laughs> Should I, what the fuck? <laughs> Leave me alone, Arthur. <laughs> Where's our bed? Let's go lay down. To the morning. We can shave. Noon. Evening. 
Let's sleep to noon. We'll sleep, wake up, talk to people, and then pretty much be ready for next episode when we actually do a main mission. I'm thinking about doing Kieran's mission first because I really am intrigued by what Kieran might have for us. And then take it from there. We're going to have to go back to New Hanover and pay that bounty. Maybe we can pay the bounty somewhere else as well. Journal. Oh. I wonder what happened. There's a coyote that we just brought back. That was it. And the tree. Okay. Nothing much going. Hey, Susan! What are you doing over here? I am mighty glad to be out of that cold, Mr. Morgan. So am I. Me too. Oh, I am getting too old for this gallivant. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> you can't greet her. It was unavailable at the moment. Try again later. Alright, let's go to Pearson's area. Let's eat. Get some coffee. And then... Can we eat? I don't think we can eat. Take, there we go. Give me that stew. Arthur's all bloodied up. <laughs> we got mauled by a bear. We ran away from the law. They shot probably a good five or six times. Hit us about five or six times. And then, well, here we are. <laughs> hey. Make a big pot. I'm starving. Okay, Mr. Morgan. Make it a good one today. Oh, I will. Anyway, didn't mean to interrupt you. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Make a big pot. I'm starving. Let me get some of that coffee. More coffee. <laughs> nice tune, Pearson. Just pound it all. Pound all that shit. <laughs> Scalding hot author is chugging. Well, we can talk to people as we drink coffee, yeah? Oh. Anything else, Pearson? No? Let's see who has anything in the camp here. What's up, Uncle? Look at him, he's drunk as hell. Have a seat and a swig, Arthur. Alright. You already drunk? It's fucking noon. Well, at least you're a happy drunk. <laughs> Happiness is important, Arthur. Well, I'll leave you to your important work. <laughs> you betcha. <laughs> Enjoy yourself, Uncle. Let's talk to Jack. Chicken. I don't want to look at the chicken. Hey, Jack. So you like the new camp, Jack? Sure. It's fine. It'll do us for now. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Uh-huh. See you, Jack. Brucey, is that you? Oh, you got blood all over you, Brucey. I gotta brush you. Brucey, you need to get... We need to put Brucey in the water. Hey, stay calm now. You're alright, boy. Damn, friends. Poor Brucey's just got blood. All over him. We need to get him in that water somewhere. We'll brush him again. Oh, the blood went off. What brushed, brushed him? I want to feed him. Brucey might have got hit there too. Classic oat cakes for you, Brucey. You got my hat. Maybe. What's my hat at? Okay, boy. Hey, we gotta get on, Brucey. Horse. Oh, here we go. Enjoy yourself, Brucey. Let's go talk to some more people here. All the chores are up, but I'm thinking chores might be an off-camera thing. There she is. What's up, Tilly? Feeling more settled here now? Yes. This is a nice spot. It is. Well. It'll do us for now. All right, Arthur. 
We almost led the law. Oh, we can play dominoes. Nothing's more romantic than a curse. Exactly. Prince turned into a toad. Lovers into stone. Entire country turned into morons. Curses everywhere. Yeah, you're talking about the curse in Valentine because I heard you. What's Valentine's curse? Well, I didn't quite understand what the woman was saying. Kind of her being a bit of an idiot, but some about a massacre and a last surviving Indian cursing the county. Well, if they massacred people, then they deserve to be cursed. Of course. You believe in curses, Arthur? No. I believe in bullets. <laughs> and not too much else. You soulless wretch. <laughs> But I like was it. it? Was it just bad luck or bad weather or something else? Something about an eagle or an owl. A gravesite. I didn't really get it. Eagle, owl, and gravesite. Mary Beth, well, you I scared? Think it sounds very interesting. You want me to go take care of it? Hey, Mary Beth. Hey, Arthur. How old are you now? 21, 22? You know, you shouldn't ask a lady such things. I feel like we heard that last time. All right. Sorry, don't mind me. Sounds good. Take it easy. Let's go talk to Karen. Because, man, that, that curse sounds so interesting. It's intriguing. Like, I want to figure out what... Where did she go? Holy. She done rolled out. Did you go out here on guard? Or let's go... No, I don't know. He's gone, gone. You know, Mr. Morgan, my lady, you got this place whipped into shape, all right. I'm trying. Can only imagine what we'd be like left to our own devices. <laughs> okay. Where's Hosea? Hi there. Hello, gentlemen. How are you? Hey. How are you? Fantastic. Josh is over here talking. Damn, we're missing it. Him and John were talking. Hi, Dutch. Arthur. Another day and we're still alive. Of course we are. <laughs> There's a question, Arthur? Of course we are. Well, anyway, best not tempt fate. All right, Arthur. Where'd you go, John? John and Arthur were... Or John and John. Josh were bickering. Hey Arthur, you'll be back on your feet in no time. I sure hope so. Yeah, we need you, John. Uh huh. You should be back on your feet now. I mean, you look like you're in pretty good shape. What? Well, I mean, who am I to say? You know. Hi, folks. Hello. Howdy. Howdy. That looks fun. I guess. Well, don't let me interrupt you. Bye bye. Have a behaving himself? For the most part. Okay, I'll leave you two to it then. Okay. I'm really wanting to know where Hosea is, because I want to talk to him. There's Uncle Hi again. There. Hey, Uncle! Hi, Uncle. Uncle's drinking again, and the sky's blue. <laughs> Just taking a break. Well, I reckon break's over. Uh-huh. Gotcha. Get back to work, Uncle. There is... Karen walking in over here. I think. I don't see Hosea around. Most people might be out and about doing things. Gotta be. Or, or there's quests. What you doing, Tilly? Nothing, Miss Grimshaw. That's right, nothing. You're useless. You're worse than useless. You're a parasite. Hey. You're a worm. Ridiculous. Get ready. But I don't want to work, Miss Grimshaw. I don't feel right. I don't care what you feel, girl. Get ready! <laughs> I gotta be so mean These to girls, her. girls, Mr. Morgan, I, it's a shame they weren't princesses in fairy tales. Well, it looks like they found their fairy godmother. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta put her back to work. She just wanted to rest a little bit. She kind of went through an ordeal in Valentine. Karen. Let me talk to Karen. Karen, where'd you go? What the fuck? 
Karen's slippery. She done rolled out again. But well, she just said Karen. Somebody over here. No. Karen! You here? There's John. Not many people here right now. So people are out and about for quests, obviously. There's Strauss over there to go talk to. And then, of course, we got Kieran to talk to, which we'll do next episode. I don't see... Karen, I've seen her in the background, but now she's not... here. And then everyone else is kind of just, uh... Hey, wild horses. Can we just take these horses, though? Think about it. Hey, Tilly, you alright? Marybeth. Karen, where'd you go? You're the only one I didn't talk to. I mean, we did. But I wanted to see if anything more would come up, maybe about the curse. But friends, we are... Our stamina is looking so good. So the only thing I got right now in the camp... It seems like we can only give food. The rest of the stuff, it doesn't look like... Oh... Well, Maybe it's locked behind tutorials still? But... We can't do nothing about it. Right now, it doesn't look like we can do anything about it. But anyways, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save here and when we get back... We'll see if anything new happens at camp. I will do the chores... Before we head out for next uh, main mission, but we're gonna do Kieran's mission next. Oh, there's Susan. I thought I was, um... Karen. We're going to do Kieran's mission next and then take it from there because looking at the map here, I think we should take care of a few more of these yellow main quests before we kind of just go off. See, like this is way over here. It's kind of just out and about in the way. I want to knock out stuff that's kind of on the way of areas. You know, speaking of which, I didn't get a chance to read Emerald, Station, Emerald Ranch. Let's read it. Read it. How we read it? Oh shit. It's not going well. Let me read Emerald Ranch. There it is. A large prosperous cattle ranch in the central heartlands. Owned by a ruthless capitalist who is intent on undermining the smaller farms in the area. The railway station nearby allows easy access to the ranch, helping it to dominate in livestock trading. Well, they didn't really seem like nice people there. Not whatsoever. Anyways, my friends, I'm out of here. Have a good one. Stay safe. See you next time. Take care.